welcome to my stream. Today. Oh shit, OBS just froze. Am I still alive? Oh fuck. Oh, we're back. Today, we're dealing with two birds on the screen. I hate birds. I hate birds. But I just want to say, there's my broken TV. Hold. And there's my new one. It's slightly bigger. I went from a 57 inch to a 65 inch. And I got a Sony. I, I, the last one was a Samsung. I don't know how much difference there truly is, but um, between like, you know, the brands. But the, the TV is pretty good so far. The only issue is it's too far up my wall. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to move it down. But I have to take like, I have to like take the screws out of the wall to do that. Um, so, personal. Oh. Oh no, Sony's so, so pretty good. I like Sony products. But, I mean, you're definitely a, um, what's it called? Against things specifically because they're popular. <laughs> what's that called? So, unless you have any very specific complaints, I'm gonna go ahead and just take that comment as that. Um, I played a bit off stream. Um, but then I remembered, oh yeah, Rex is moving, so I was only to play one day. Yeah, we have a Sony TV too. Oh. All right, well, we'll see how, we'll see if this one lasts longer than a year. Um, oh yeah, I also got a bunch of Nook Miles tickets off stream. Um, I figured that would be nice. Also, wow, the, this really just kind of popped up in the perfect spot, huh? Bring. Bring. The only bad thing about mine was the leg. Full leg with what? The fine leg. No kicky. I gotta put my shovel on first. Well, I'll, well, well, I say mine, but it's my family's one. Uh, yeah, I, I figured that. Leg and menus? Oh, yeah. Honestly, my Samsung had that same problem. It's annoying to, like, type shit out because you press it and then it takes almost a full second for it to move. Well, it's like half a second. Which doesn't sound that bad, but it really is. It's pretty annoying. I'm glad you're here. Ha! You're pretty silly. Reminds me of a car band. That was in for good was Santa. Oh, yeah. We gotta take this crap off now. But yeah, so I was a t-shirt on the stream today. Today was mostly me... Can I pick up all this stuff? What? Just take it off! Oh. If I can keep that stuff on under the wetsuit, why is it... Make me take it off to remove it. We're going nakey nakey pants. Oh shit, it just like scrolls over. That's interesting. I thought, they, I thought like, you know, the shirt and pants would have their specific spots. We're even taking the freaking boots off, man. Yeah. But, um, yeah. <laughs> I saved like $200 on this TV all saved. It, it was $1,000 before taxes though. So it was like 1100 or something like that. Uh, combine that with the VR set, I spent like 2000 I spent $2,000 on my last vacation too in the summer. What is with me going on my like vacation from work? And then uh, having to, uh, and then paying copious amounts of money and without even really meaning to. Ooh, this has been up here for a few days. Count done, fine. All's well that ends well, or so the saying goes. On New Year's Eve, we'll come together in the plaza. We'll ring in the... New Year with a grand countdown. I'm probably going to be doing this because uh, I was going to maybe see a couple friends. Also, it's Bob's birthday coming out on the first. I was going to see a couple friends, but they're all, literally all my friends are busy. So that's not happening anymore. Oh, that's kind of sucks a little bit. All available. Wow, 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 wow. I think I'm a Samsung fanboy. Samsung, like, I mean, I haven't, I've really only been playing with this TV for a little bit. But the leg on the news menu seemed a lot uh, better than, than my Samsung was. It's still there and it's still annoying. Like, it was it was like a full second on my uh, Samsung. But this one, it's not as bad, so. I don't know why. Like, why have remotes regressed for it? It's unbelievable, man. Never, ever, ever had any leg with, like, TVs. You know, like, tube TVs. That's frustrating. Like, maybe there's a reason for it. But I'm also, like, I'm, like, half convinced there's a reason for it. And I'm also half convinced that, like, companies put this stupid shit in anyways just to have something for them to upgrade later. Old TVs are still so sick. 
Wow, you're really into that golden ages on huh? Is that a real term? My, my films teacher said that. And it really kind of like rang true to me. That some people just like, you know, <laughs> the people are like, oh, the good old days, everything's horrible today. But then back then, wow, life was great. It's like, no, there's still really good things today. There's people only tend to remember the good things from the past. Unless, you know, it's something real bad, like let's say like 9 11 or something. Oh, yeah, I ordered a bunch of stuff. These are all the seasonal things. That's why I ordered them. Ashmina. Oh, how'd you get me the perfect birthday gift? Are you a mind reader or something? It was wrong to pick on the list I never wrote down in anywhere. Anyway, I liked it so much, I got you something too. Still kind of spooky, Ashmina. I want to keep that later. I'll grab that stuff later. I might, if there's a midwinter sweater. I might have already had that. Oh, have my Xbox for apps, so that's fine too. That's actually kind of something that's been cool on this. I'm able to get Twitch on my TV. I download it, and it's, yeah, it works. Twitter, Facebook. Um, it's it's like what? My last TV certainly didn't have that, so that's kind of interesting. But I mean, I have my PS4 for apps too, if I if I need to. Oh uh, yeah, we got a sandy beach flooring from a uh, balloon, or no, from the beach, I think. Mermaid vanity from Pascal. Uh, the frozen counter. I also got the festive tree, the big festive tree. Unfortunately, I got this after Christmas, so this is no longer of any use to me, but it's still nice to hang. Uh, we'll put this away, we'll put that away, that away. I mean, it's better than being, oh, is it better than being taken? <laughs> Uh, consoles are actually, are actually useful as a Blu-ray player, yeah. Um, don't say I have many Blu-rays these days, though. Blu-rays are already kind of on their way out when I, like, you know, when I was growing up. Kind of. Streaming is just completely taking over all that. This is, that way? Yes, there we go. Yes, what? What? Oh, I was done anyways. Um, I don't really need all this inventory space. I was making room for inventory for villager hunting, but I guess I don't really need to do that. I guess we could just start that now, because why not? Why not? Oh, it's literally snowing every single day. It's annoying. I mean, it's fine, but... Uh, ladder. It's fine. But, like, the flowers, man. The flowers are going crazy. Uh, Sally, I need to work on you for your phone. I, I'm falling real far behind. I It's been literal months since I've given my villagers gifts. I need to start doing that again. Let's do the snowman first, and then we'll start exploring. It's a new spot. Careful. Don't teach the tree. The only thing I used my PS4 really was to watch Crunchyroll for a little bit, but... Hey, Dung Beetle, relax! That, that was the only, like, app I used. That and, like, when friends over, like, I'll play, like, uh... Jack, 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 Jack's Box. Jackbox? Jackbox. Oh, no, Koshu. You just hate everything, huh, Luca? You should be happy. <laughs> you should just stop shitting on everything. You'll live a happier life that way. Come on, how did he get down here already? Good lord, dude. Um, I made a, well, I, I played two days, right? So the first day I played, um, I made a perfect snowman, I think. And then the second day I, uh, I, I didn't. So it sucks to be me, I guess. Oh, but I'm just pressing down and the game's like, nope, you want to go right? Trust me, dude. That looks pretty close. Hey, perfect. Wow. Yeah, but Crunchyroll is pretty not the Well, guess what, dude? So is pretty much every company in the world, so. <laughs> you're wearing a shirt today? Well, unless you bought it locally. You're probably buying some, uh, you're buy probably buying some, um, kid that works in a sweatshop for 20 hours a day. So, yeah. Dorian Dress! Oh, hell yeah! Dude, this actually looks hella sick, bro. That, that started off as me 
being unironic. <laughs> nah, dude, let's don't do that. You sure about that? Let's see. Let's just try. Okay, let's see it here. Adidas. I know that's how you're supposed to say it. Unethical. Let's well, unethical practices. Highlight several our research highlights several ethical issues with the Adidas. They include workers' rights, paying excessively high wages to executives while failing to pay a garment worker supply chain enough to even cover basic needs. As you were saying, Luca. What are other please tell me what other companies you support that I can do a quick Google search to <laughs> improve otherwise said. It sucks, man. It really does, but I mean that's Yeah, ne Nestle. Yeah, I hear they're pretty bad. I'm a pretty girl. Roger, Dodger. I think I have a villager list. Do I not? Her villager personality. Here we go. Hey. I still have a list from last time. So right now, Snooty Anka, that was probably loud. Normal Fauna, Sally, Uchi, Pashmina, Peppy Twiggy. Lazy is just Bob now. Rex was there, but obviously he's moved out. Grumpy Apollo is moved. Oh, frick. Shut up! Ah, oh, it's why that's so loud. Was it how loud is that? Hold on, I'm gonna try one more time. Already? Three, two, one. That's pretty fucking loud, dude. Oh my god. Why, why is there no, like, good mixer? I was so excited because I thought I found a cool mi That was... Actually, not that loud. Um, I was so excited because I, I found, like, I found a mixer. Like, cool. Can't wait to use that. Turns out it doesn't do any... It, it literally, it's, the it's like a super complicated version of just the normal Windows, like, mixer. And I don't see why people use it. But then also phones. What about them? But they're unethical, too. I mean, yeah. But why point that out? Who did a Paul? Hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh yeah, right now. But who? Apollo moved out. Who moved in? Wasn't that Keen? I have Keen on this list though. Frick. Jamie, what's up? Do you like my dress? Do you like my dress? No. He's back. What the fuck? What are the odds of that? That's actually insane. <laughs> he's already forgotten me. It's been less than 24 hours and he's forgotten me. What the hell, dude? Oh yeah, I don't have to search the trees anymore for items because I I, I have the reward ready. I'll take a little peek skis for the uh, item on the beach though, if there is one. New Year's Day is a Friday. Okay. I think maybe on either the Friday or the Saturday is going to be my Smash TV stream. Is that like 1 in 400? I don't know. I guess I, I guess just 1 in wh however many I have. That's actually nuts. That's actually pretty nuts. That was the first. Not only that, but it was the first village I saw. Which I guess wouldn't change the odds of it. My clothing options are this. I mean, to be fair, I love like that dark blue and black. That that's cool. Or a second dress of me wearing a pink zap. What are, like what? Why am I cursed? Why why does life make a mockery of me so? Forever and ever. Oh, Amen. All right. Oh shit! I forgot to look and see who is in my village. Nice white and gold dress. <laughs> Uh, no, it's blue and black. God dang it! Excuse me. 
So we have one of every villager, it looks like. Still, it's, um, so that's cool. Who? Angus? Who art thou? Angus! That's a grumpy. Do I have a grumpy? Well, according to my list, I don't have any. Uh, it just says Apollo, but Apollo moved out. Apollo did move out, right? I'm pretty sure he did. Sally, I have Sally on there. Yeah, Fauna, Anka, Pashmina, Twiggy, Bob, Dom, Keen. Who am I missing? Yo. Well, Bob, um, heavy metal. This is Top Top Pocket Watch. Do you require assistance? Over. You scare me, you stupid bird! You stupid dodo! Wait a minute, you're supposed to be extinct! What are you doing here, huh? Is there a particular villages you're hoping for? Just really, Jitters is the only one I really want. We'll see who else I find, though. Um, Alright, let's finally take a little peek skis. Who am I forgetting? Mm -hmm. Psych, that's the wrong number. Apollo still does live here. What the hell? I thought he moved out. Wow, I was very certain he had moved. Maybe he offered to move out, and I said, nope. Huh, interesting. Yeah, I'm really just looking for jitters, or I guess, like, I have one of every villager. And I have two of normal girl. Wow, I have one very villager and then two of the normal girls, and then that's that, that's everything. So I guess I'll just take whoever um whoever whoever fits my fancy. I, I don't gotta you know Rex the lazy moved out, but I still have Bob, so I'm not specifically looking for a lazy. Mm -hmm. yeah. If Dom, the only jock in town, moved out, then I'd be looking for another jock. Dom does not seem like a jock to me at all. It's funny he's a jock. Funny ha ha, funny he he. <laughs> yeah, but I'll just I'll just kind of stop whenever I see a villager that fan that I fancy, which is not you. I have no idea who the hell you are. What? Is he a uh? I think he's a jock, right? Just based on the the the, the survival thing. That seems like a very jocky thing to say, right? Roy. Mm -hmm. Ooh, oh man <sighs> Long day I couldn't fall asleep at all last night I didn't fall asleep at like 4am I don't know what's with me in going on vacation From work and then like immediately My excuse I was like well Time to fall to shit no matter how careful I try to be I just can't sleep it sucks because like I want nothing more than to get up at like 8 a.m. every morning and then just like get we're in the grind. Cause I, I am I I feel like when I get a good sleep and I wake up in the morning, I am pretty like efficient and I work well. But uh, I can't do that. <laughs> I didn't get out of bed till like I think it was after 12. So sucks to be me, I guess. Maybe tomorrow should be the stream where I where I destroy my television. I don't know. I don't know, but I should figure that out like immediately. Tomorrow's also my final day to get footage for a video I want to do on Flash Player that I literally haven't even finished writing yet. Get getting Luca's sleep schedule. I hope it doesn't get that bad. Hey, well, like I only have a few days left of my vacation, which sucks. Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. I only have four days of my eleven days left. Ugh. I should have taken two weeks. I'm an idiot. I only get three weeks of holidays a year, so I'm like, okay, I'll take one week in the winter and then two weeks in the summer. But maybe I should do the opposite. Ooh. Isn't that guy's name Kyle or something? Kyle's kind of I like the wolves. Is he grumpy? He's not. It is Kyle, though. Let's see. Um, Kyle New Horizons. Who are you? 
Meow, 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 meow. This is going to probably be a short stream, by the way. Tomorrow, maybe I'll do a bunch, maybe. Um, he's smug. Should I go with him? Name's Kai. I'm a wolf about town on this case about islands. Flash got activated, though. Or archived, though. I mean, kind, not, I mean... <laughs> The regular sites, which are kind of like half the experience going to those sites. Like, um, you know, Mini Clip, um, Albino Black Sheep, Newgrounds, like all those sites. Like, a lot of those are like, they're, they're just switching to HTML. I don't know about the game sites, though. That I do not know about. I don't, I don't know. But I like the arc, the archive you're talking about. It's like just a website that lists all, like, all the old games, right? Flashpoint far superior. You're missing the point, though, dude. And you're. S Wait! Wait, did I invite him or not? I didn't invite him! I got distracted by talking about Flash. It's fine. I don't care about that much. But that's kind of exciting. It's like, cool. We, we get to finish it up early and get to do other stuff. Fuck, that sucks. Oh, man. I'm so dumb. Oh yikes! I got distracted. It's your fault. I'm just kidding, but it's my fault. I, I'm I'm dumb. Wow, that sucks. All right, well, <laughs> I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna pro I'm probably not gonna be too picky though. So we'll see. We'll see who we find next. <laughs> wow. Me big dum dum. Me 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 big dum dum. That, but like that time was over long ago. Anyways, it was, but I mean, it still doesn't change the fact that it meant a lot to me and a lot of other people. But I mean, you're kind of too young for that. Wait, did I get him? <gasps> Wait, I did take him. Oh, it meant a lot to me too. Yeah, but you didn't grow up with it. <laughs> It's different from, you know, like, that was, like, the latest and greatest technology. And that, like, the Flash amazed me and, like, all my classmates as a kid. You mean we could play computer games for free? But now it's, like, you know, they all look like shit. Reach. Well, I did. That wasn't, like, the latest and greatest technology it, it's different it's different growing up with something like that than like you know just discovering it later on am i i am old because that was like it was like the latest and greatest technology for like quite a while and it was really cool that was super early days but i still grew up with it all right well i'm not gonna sit here and argue with you about it but i guess i took kyle well, I guess we'll see tomorrow if Kyle moves in or just God forbid, uh, what's his face? Uh, or, um, like, uh, the, uh, who's that Graham moves back in or something like that? I can't wait for that to happen. What did the snowman teach me? Oh, man. Hold on. I'm going to spend three years going to the top of the list now. Cause there's no up back back up the top for some godforsaken reason. <gasps> a frozen table. A peach head. A butt hat. I guess. Well, did it say sold? Can I get confirmation, please? Oh shit. Oh, I, I honestly have zero memory of me accepting him, but okay. I probably sang like ten time ten k hours in the flash game. Cool. Hello, Fano. Week like 2020 is almost over. Ah. I sure can, Fauna. I sure can. Uh, was I already in Nook's shop today? I don't remember. My chin do be itchy, though. My chin do be itchy, though. Oh, I wasn't here. Yeah, I saw this crazy. I like the toast with the nook face on it. Remember something cool about going to that one site, logging to your account, and just click through the site and find new and cool games. 
See, that's how I know you're lying. <laughs> what new games? There haven't been new games forever. No one makes flash games anymore. Twiggy! My best friend! <coughs> My bestie! I didn't want to click that. I want to talk to Twiggy. Oh, can I coordinate you? Yeah, I think that's not even Yeah, can you actually? Yeah, you could coordinate. Oh, I thought she was actually going to do that. I first want to reload for when I find in some cues, but I promise it. That was like 2008. You're so 2000. When she, how old were you? How, when were you born? Uh, see, I spend my bells with as little thought as possible. I never asked for someone something. Because you're like, you're like high school. I know you did like an electric or like, what was it? Man, I know you did like some kind of career thing and then it's, you stopped doing that, right? But that was like, I think that was a high school thing. No, or am I wrong? I remember you doing that, but I do not remember the details. Can I just get like jeans or something? <laughs> yeah. Oh, God. These raccoons have forsaken me. Ugh. I can wear some shorts. <laughs> They've forsaken me to a skirt, a frilly pants, or shorts in the winter. I cannot change my fate, but I can rise up to meet it. What says that? Some movie or show says that? Yeah, that, that looks fabulous, dude. Wait! Yes. I was gonna get socks, but now. I'm 17. So that was 12 years ago. So, it would have been five? I don't even know. <laughs> uh, I don't know if I had like I was allowed on the computer. I don't think so. They ever try to distract yourself from the cold by experimenting with warm outfit. I think that for computer was kind of forbidden to me. I don't think we are no. Nice five. I think maybe we just didn't have internet, which is nuts to think about. There was a time in my life where we just literally didn't have internet. I heard a weird noise outside my door. Then we had Windows XP. Yeah, we had Windows. First, the first Windows we, I remember having is Windows 95. I remember, like, there was, like, a, um, a gold nugget. There was, uh, one of the first programs we got for the Windows 95. It was, like, a, it was, like, a weird, like, house design or something like that for my mom. I don't know. I think she was going to use it to try and, like, help, like, design what her house was looking like. I don't really remember. Oh, I miss XP. XP was definitely like when I think of like childhood windows, I think of XP for sure. Mm. We don't get hammer or something, or someone like banging on something. It's weird. Kinda weird, bro. Kinda weird. All right. Well, uh, we got a new villager. That's good. Let's go see what Dom's up to. Should maybe get some gifts prepared for my my brethren. It's felt so comfy. Yeah, that that grass plains. Apparently, that field's been destroyed. The classic Windows XP background. Need to spread my creativity. What do you think? You're not gonna believe it. I mean, that choppy case. Dude, I just got this recipe from, like, it was already a double. I already got this recipe just, like, a couple days ago, though. I don't want those ancient ball now. <laughs> yeah, I mean. 2008? Even my, my rural, root, root. I can't, wow, I can't say that word, apparently. My root, root, no, 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 not rural. That, that's city. Uh, my. No, urban city. I always got those two words mixed up. Uh, hey, dear. Freaking sweet, bro. My, uh, yeah, my rural, rural, rural town had already the laser mouses at that point. I guess maybe it's different in Germany. I don't know. I have no idea how, like, the economical, um, 
Yeah. I, I don't know how Germany works well. How far behind you guys are in technology. I've noticed over the years, Canada seems to be about like five years behind like general technology in the U.S. Wistful. Do I have that? Uh, wist. Apparently I have it. Damn, Windows 7 wasn't even out back then. See, like, Windows 7 still feels, like, relatively new to me. That's academic, right? But that's fake. It was a copy stain. Are they all fake again? Uh, unless the Wistful's real, but, I mean, now they have that, so I don't care. Scary. I know there's a fake version of this, and it's depending on which way his eyebrows go. Oh, yes! I want to open the link. That's why I clicked it. Good God. Yeah, it's the fake one. Well, I'm getting nostalgic. I'd say that's true for a lot of aspects. I've heard Americans say the same thing. For what? For, for like being behind? Like, I guess, I guess it depends where you live in the States, too. I guess, well, like, when I notice something like that, this artwork is always genuine. Okay, I don't think I have this one. Uh, Smug, Keaton, and then Kyle. Okay, sorry, I just didn't want to put this pledge list. I'm pretty sure this is going to be the first time I have a, uh... <gasps> I've been getting such bad luck with the paint, with the art. I have so many more to get still. I have... 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. I have 22 of these left to get. And I'm like, just, like this time I got to buy just the skin of my teeth. The very last painting I checked was something I needed. Last time, I think about two times, everything was either fake or I had everything. But yeah, Flash games were the shit back then. They were insanely popular too. They're like... Being Canadian, being behind on the U.S. culture, yeah. Yeah, I believe that. What's up, Twiggy? We already talked to you. Uh, achoo! Ugh, it's getting too cold out there. Last day of 2020. Last day of 2020 tomorrow. It feels like years flew by, but also dragged. But also flew. Weird, right? You just have... You just... You have to have... What? You have to have to have to join us in the New Year's countdown. And party into the New Year. Probably, Twiggy. Not as bad as mobile games. Well, that's the thing. Like, Flash games were pretty bad. I mean, the only thing, you know, that mobile games are real shit compared to, um, uh, compared to, um, why can't I, why, why do I, like, just forget what I'm saying? Um, the only, like, shitty thing, like, mobile games have versus mobile, or versus Flash is the fact that, uh, you know, the money shit. Like, all the ads. Oh, there are ads on Flash games, too. But they're never that intrusive. You know, sometimes you'd see an ad before you play a game. And then never again until, like, you switch games. But there would never... You would never, like, die and then have to watch an ad. From what I remember. I could be wrong. And maybe there's some games out there. Or maybe that happen all the time. And I just forgot. But, um... I never had an ad blocker back then, either. So, you know. I think I already talked Flash Man, didn't I? Flash has some really good games, though, and so does Mobile. <laughs> mobile has some great games, too. I'm very involved with this. Wait, I think you said it's next one. I'm the first. All right. So, time to plan a rock and party. Wham. Ooh. One of my favorite games to play on mobile, I'm, this was years ago. I was still in high school when this happened, so keep in mind I'm 25, going on 26 in a few months. So keep that in mind. But like, Random Heroes 2, I think it was called. That was a fantastic game. 
And that was a, that was a phone game. I never really got too far into phone games though, so I don't really have any more. Clash of Clans is really fun too, and it's like very playable without spending a shit ton of money. Like I never spent a cent, and I got pretty far in that game before. You know, it does get grindy, but like it gets super grindy hundreds of hours in, not like tens of hours or a few hours in, like most mobile games. I quite enjoyed it. I don't know if it's different these days. It might, it might not be. I don't know. But uh, it was really fun when I played it like five years ago or so. Except Apollo. You can answer me this. You see, I had this old apron. But I plum forgot and brought a new one. You can why. Why do I keep getting woman's clothes? Like, Asmodel is better than the games. Yeah, those ones where you shoot the target someone in an iPod. I remember that. Those pesky hands. See, people say that stuff all the time, but I feel like in like 20 years, or not even that, like 10 years time, people are going to look back at all the shitty mobile ad, like, you know, all the really bad ones, like the, you know, like the, the mafia ones, like people are going to 100% look back on those and feel the same way that you guys are talking about, like, you know, those, those win an iPod ads. It's going to happen, I, I guarantee they They're, they're kind of made to be dumb and stupid and people are going to look back at them and like, they're going to laugh about them, you know? <laughs> I think people often forget like how annoying something is and it gets replaced by nostalgic after nostalgia after a while Just play flash games on a site that just rips the games and then gives them silly translated titles and monetizes them really That sounds about right Sorry Rex you gotta go in the trash Throw it above the light switch you son of a bitch Oh my god, fine! No, what? I pressed down. Downtown and an alley around. Oh, that's Stella's photo? I don't remember that. Bing, bing. You know what's also really dumb? I haven't been giving any of my villagers presents. But look how many presents I have for them. I have a huge stack. I don't know how many we need. That's a lot of tickets I have. Oh no, okay, thank god. Okay, oh, it's psych, I hit the wrong button. Congregate, I never really used Congregate. I used uh, andcon.com was my main site, mostly because that site wasn't blocked on computers at my school. It was one of the very few, so we, like, me and all my friends used that. I used Miniclip a little bit, um... Uh, what else? I don't remember. I don't remember what else. Addicting Games, probably. That's a German site, obviously. Oh, it's Congregate. Is that German? I don't, I don't even know. Is congregate a German word? It could be. <laughs> it's definitely an English word too, but it sounds like it could be. Alright. <clears throat> Sally, are you gonna accept my iron lamp wall crap? Nah, I was just listening to say I never use oh I see. Just press off a snowflake. Do you want a snowflake? I wonder what that size. A severed head. It's a severed head. I can't believe Rex has finally gone. That's actually crazy to me. I forgot he's even moving out. He's been here for many moons. Have I talked to you today? I think so. I do believe. I was going on Newgrounds a few times, but I never knew it was the real deal. I was afraid to go on Newgrounds as a kid because I heard there were boobies on there, and um, I didn't want to get in trouble. So I like I was horrified to go to that site. So I went to a different site instead called uh, Albino Black Sheep, which really would just mostly take um like the best of on new grounds and i was gonna go for that fish for some reason oh, wow, let's get it Ooh, i have a good feeling about this fish why to get this black bass oh, it's not it's too big they're small 
But even even like albino black sheep have very <laughs> some very risque animations, I'll say. And my feelings were wrong. Um, Pashmina, I have your photo. Apollo, I have his photo. Twiggy, I have her photo. Dom, I don't think no, I don't have his photo yet, and he's inside. So let's go give him the gift. But the gift that keeps on giving. <laughs> You know, if I had to go on Newgrounds, I like eight-year-old just look up movies. Yeah, see, I was like, I was a good boy, and I was horrified to do that. Even when I was so started to look up, you know, I remember the first time I looked up, I, the very first thing I looked up ever, I think, was something like naked girl boobies or something like that. <laughs> Mostly because I was curious, like, is this on the internet? There's no way that's on the internet. Little did I know. <laughs> Can you play Mario Kart 63? I don't think so. I played Super Flash Bros. Though. No, that no, not the that's Smash, right? That's the big Smash one. I play like a Super Mario Bros. Flash game though. I played a couple of those. There's, there's quite a few of those actually. You know what? I just saw this right now and it really pisses me off. You guys know how Nintendo like cease and desists like all these like you know fan games of Nintendo stuff, right? Meanwhile, if you look at the app store, there's like a million different Mario fake games and Zelda fake games and all that shit, and they'll just stay up there forever. It's like all the shitty, like, you know, foreign games that are just being pumped into the app stores. They always got to stay there and make a shit ton of money, but the fan games that literally, like, are meant to make no profit, those get taken down. I'm sure there's like a reach. There's like a there's a reason for that. Like Nintendo can't reach, you know. I'm guessing. A lot, I'm pretty sure a lot of these come from like China, right? Um, they can't. I'm guessing they just can't reach the people over there. But that's still that's so that's so. Played so many bad Mario Flash games. Uh, I played one called Koopa's Revenge. That sounds familiar. I probably played that. He plays a Koopa playing Mario like levels. That's funny. That sounds familiar. I've at least heard of that. Oh yeah, Bob did put out his giant tent again for Christmas. What the hell's wrong with you, Bob, huh? <laughs> but at least he's wearing his cute apron. Mm -mm -mm. Spilled wonky on it. Well, matches the, the colorful house he has, but it doesn't look very good still. <sighs> it snows too much. My town is overrun. It's been years since I've seen the ground. I probably even thought they were official. <laughs> I didn't even really thought about, you know, if that was even a thing. Like, it never even crossed my mind. Like, are these official? It's like, I don't Like, when I played those, I was like 8 2, so I was like, I don't care. Anka! She has her puppy! So my puppy plush in my home? I suppose I am too. It's a story, of course, but suffice to say, I'm deep touched by to my puppy plushie. Yeah, the story is I gave it to you for Christmas. Hello? Stupid bitch. Uh. Uncle Bells, Uncle Bells, Uncle Smells, Eggs. Am I crazy? Or is this flower look deeper purple than this one does? Hmm. I thought my shovel was breaking. I thought my shovel was breaking. Mostly played those point click games. I was more into like the Mario clones. I mean, not really the Mario clones specifically, but platformer games. Like Fancy Pants Man, Save the Sheriff was a really like that was a, that was one of my favorite games ever. I love Save the Sheriff. Um, I guess gonna hunt for the lobster too. It'll do around that. We're already approaching an hour. I, this is gonna be a short stream because I do have a like, I do have some stuff I really gotta work out on tomorrow. I'll, I'll probably stream quite a bit. I'll also be streaming to midnight tomorrow, so, you know, come to that if you want. Curses, follow the end. 
person's follow the game. God, Super Mario 63 is good. Man, I, I might play that. I don't really know. I don't really remember what that is. Like, if I saw a screenshot of it or something, perhaps I would be able to uh, confirm whether I played it. But nah. it was one of the escape rooms. Yeah, that's funny, huh? I bet those escape rooms probably prompted the entire escape room business, right? I'm guessing. I don't really know for sure. That might be wrong and real stupid to say. That's very possible. But oh yeah, Keaton was fishing. I couldn't give him a gift. Probably still a fishing though. Villagers that fish tend to fish for a long ass time, so. Okay, kinda glad I can't fit anything on my wall there. Kinda glad, kinda glad. Shall be a freaking nerd, okay? Oh, I'm gonna put that away. Um, away with you. Away with you. Get rid of the rest of this crap. They probably did. Yeah, I don't know. Like, I don't know if, like, that would make that makes the most sense, right? But I don't know if there's something else I'm not realizing or something like that. Well, that's funny, like those games kinda of, that, that genre of flash game <laughs> inspired an entire business. I don't know how well those are doing these days. I that was you know what when the escape rooms came out, like the first thing I thought was like, that's definitely something that's gonna be like cool for a while, but like there's no way that business will be around another like ten years. And I feel like the pandemic is probably kinda, you know. Not only the nail in the coffin of those, you know, escape rooms, but then obviously a lot of businesses as well, but notably, probably the escape rooms. Or notably for the conversation. I mean, escape room flash games are probably, oh yeah, yeah, they were very, they are extremely popular back then. I never really cared for them though. I found them annoying. I found them kind of bullshit too, you know, it's like, you, oh, you turn on the tap in the bathroom and a key comes out. It's like, how the hell are you supposed to, like, what? A lot of them had like really dumb logic like that, so I got I got real sick of them real quick. Or I felt real stupid when I couldn't figure out like a very obvious puzzle. So I don't like games that make me feel stupid. <laughs> so that's why I play baby Nintendo games. I look so dumb with these glasses. Go I'm going to a boxing match with glasses on. Sounds like a good idea. Alright, you silly little raccoon bastards. You're gonna take my stinking stuff and you're gonna like it. I gotta go put that away. Do not sell the golden rod. Can I do that? Oh, duh, of course you can. Man's gotta see. True, especially when he's getting punched in the face. One of the very few fights I got into when I was in high school, I was wearing glasses and the lens got punched out of my glasses into my eye. And then I went to the bathroom to fix it. And then and then the dude I got into a fight with was claiming I was crying my eyes out in the bathroom. That made me so mad. <laughs> that wasn't, I really wasn't. I was fixing my glasses and making sure they're okay, but no. He was like, hey, he just cried in the bed. Ah, I was so mad. Oh, sure, now Keaton's out, huh? Frick you, Keaton, you frickin' frick. I was so sure he would still be fishing for the next three years. For the next three years? Alright, looking for lobster. School's done. I don't know. I mean, I, I mean... I feel like a lot of people... Well... I don't know where this carefully. Um, high school is a big part of your life, and I also do feel bad for the people that didn't get like a good experience in high school. Um, because like it's something you know everybody talks about. You, you know, 
you, you listen in on like a seven year old man's conversation and you know listen in long enough, I guarantee you like remember back in high school when we did this? Oh, oh we used to drive around and get it to the parking lot. <laughs> you know? <laughs> so it really sucks when people don't have like any positive memories from high school. That shit follows you pretty much. Like, so like I didn't particularly enjoy high school that much, but like I knew like going into it, I knew that like it would be a big part of my life whether or not I had a good time or not. So I always tried to like make it like as good as possible and have like a lot of good memories of social and I do. I have some really bad memories of social with school in general too, but I was trying to like make sure I had some like good experiences too, you know. I actively like even though it was really fucking hard a lot of the times. Well not a lot of times. Sometimes it was. I shouldn't say all like a lot of the times, but but I always like kinda, you know I've always been the kind of person that I'll do stuff just to get a memory out of it. Um, even if it's not a very smart thing to do. Uh, not not, you know, I wouldn't do like meth to get a story out of it or something. But I mean like, I don't know. Chris, you should jump your bike over that 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 twenty foot gap that goes twenty thousand feet down below the ocean. Okay. <laughs> kind of. I mean, I, I mean that's obviously a huge exaggeration. In fact, I don't really like things that could result in pain, and I would actively kind of avoid them. So that's actually a very bad example. <laughs> but I'm just saying, I would like I, I I like to try like and do things, even if it makes a fool out of myself. As long as people are laughing, I don't care. People can laugh at me. I'm fine with that. As long as people are being a good time, and as long as it's not in like, you know, bad fit. Like, there's a difference between someone actively like making fun of me or something like that, literally just to, like get under my skin, versus like me being roasted, you know, to make everyone laugh. Like, I'm okay with being roasted as long as it's, you know, in good fun, I guess, or not in bad faith. Oh, I was a clown too. Damn it! I was hoping that would be it. Yeah. So we're looking for the lobster. It disappears at the end of January. I don't think it appears again. It does appear, but I think it's only in Southern Hemisphere. But I think you have to wait a whole year to get it again. But it disappears at the end of January, so it's fine if I don't catch it right now, but I'm gonna do an inventory or two of that. So people start taking advantage. How so? A dog crab. I ever see the dun Dungeoness Crab, it reminds me of Dungeoneering from RuneScape, which is a skill. It was like a raid skill. Make fun of me to feel bad? Okay, I see. Yeah, that sucks. Yeah, yeah you gotta like know when to stand up for yourself too. You can't let people walk over you. Because if you let people know that you, they, you could walk or they could walk over you, not gonna do anything about it, then yeah, that could get ugly pretty quick. I've had, I've had, I've definitely had people I've known that that you know, it started off as being fun and games, and then slowly it just became more mean spirited over time. Like one one guy, he uh, I start like he was one of my very first friends when I moved back to the city for the, um at the end of the eighth grade, and like he was. He'd ro we'd roast each other a little bit, but then he started getting really mean, and then he would like start punching me, or punching me. He'd punch me in the arm, like I was like, "Ha ha, you're funny, punch!" But it'd be like a hard fucking punch. And I kept telling him, "Don't fucking do that." And then one day, like I was in gym class with my friends, and I was, you know, I was kind of ranting to one of my other classmates about this guy that kept punching me. And then he was like, "Yeah, he keeps punching me too." And then he pulled up his shirt, and he had like a fucking big ass bruise, like on his entire upper arm. And I was like. I was so mad, and then he just kind of conveniently walked up to us at the time, and I flipped my shit on him. And that was funny, because then he got, like, super, like, kind of submissive towards me for a little bit. So I guess he did feel bad. But he comes from a bad home. His, like, older brother is, like, in a gang, and then his dad's, like, a like a really bad alcoholic. So I, like, I feel bad for him. At the same time, he, like, he was super, like, from that, like, he was really, like, after he was submissive for me for a few days, after that, he started getting super aggressive towards me, and he kept trying to fight me over and over again and like i don't want to fight him his brother's a drug dealer like i know like he can fight <laughs> it's like there's no way that's a... <laughs> i don't want to die <laughs> so yeah i have no qualms with like fighting someone maybe if like you know well as a last resort like i'm never gonna like you know if someone bums into me at a party with a drink and spills their drink on me i'm like bro did you spill your drink on me 
That's a thrown hit, bro. Like, I would never do that. Shit's so stupid. Um, like, as a last resort, I will, like, fight someone that I think is, like, fair, I guess. Uh, like, that's coming from someone that's been in maybe, like, a few fights in his life. Um, but yeah, I, I mean, <laughs> y'all's, like, a kind of own to pick your battles. Like, there's no way I'd pick a fight with, like, a six foot seven, 400 pound dude. Nope. That's, that's dumb. Teachers doesn't help either. Yeah, it's a thing. Like, honestly, going to teachers for, like, bullying and stuff doesn't really do. In fact, I would, I would even say it makes it worse all the time. I just kept saying ignore them. Yeah. No, really, I shouldn't say ignore them. But, like, in my school, and I guess in a lot of, at least, North American schooling... If, like, if, like, a bully fights you and, like, you know, it's very actively known that you're being bullied, like, you get suspended and the bully. You both get suspended, even, like, even if you don't do anything. It's ridiculous. I don't know. I think it takes, like, probably. I mean, under the right circumstances, sure. You know. Maybe he's sleeping in his bed and then I just, like, have, like, a shotgun on me. But even then, like, who knows, right? <laughs> Maybe, sh maybe, wait, was it, did Shaq like a superhero at some point or something? Or like a superhuman? He probably would grab the barrel of shotgun, like bend it up and then, you know, I would shoot it and then it'd be like Bugs Bunny where it would just go in the loop and just shoot me in the face instead. And it wouldn't kill me. I would just get like a big puff of black smoke on me from the, sh from the shotgun like it's a Looney Tunes movie or something. All right, well, you're not fast, so you're not, you're an enemy. Yeah, school can be rough. I mean, I used to believe people too, yeah. Yeah. It's... It looks like they say the high school never ends. And I mean, being 25 now and seeing, like, you know, seeing old classmates and how the way they talk and, like, social media and stuff, it's like... Yeah, that person never really grew up, huh? <laughs> I was talking, like, he'd show me a post from, like, 2007, then show me a post from today, and then they look exactly the same. Some people. Some people do, but, like, I have always noticed, like, a really red flag with someone is if they happen to mention no drama a lot, a lot. If they say no drama, they're typically, like, the super dramatic type, and very like you know uh immature oh, glad we gimme gimme i'm just knocking these out like gangbusters i don't know what that means the grown man he's 40. true can you confirm are you 40 luca you said you're i already forget you're 17 right is that what you said Need brain no work. It sucks so much. Like my memory is so bad. People will tell me stuff and then I'll immediately forget it. And I felt really bad because it's like, you know, I don't want people to think I'm ignoring them. Even though I definitely am. No, it's just my brain just like I'll see like an important fact and I'll be like, that's cool, but then for some reason. I feel like a normal person's brain would be like, okay, that's important. Commit that to memory. But my brain's like, that's cool. All right, right into the right into the trash with you. And then, like, I just immediately forget whatever they just said. Or not really immediately, but, like, within a few minutes, it'll just be gone. It'll be... Unless I make, like, a, an effort. If I make, like, an effort to remember something, like, I can know I'm okay at that. But even then, it's, like, a lot of times not really. <laughs> but it helps a little bit, I notice. But even then, it's like, I can never, like... When you think about something, I guess you just kind of, like, assume your brain's gonna remember it. But, like, I have to specifically think, remember this, Chris. And even then, it doesn't work all the time. It sucks! I'm still pretty young, but I can definitely see how much I've changed. I mean, that's life in general, you know? I feel like a 7-year-old will look back when they're, like, 50 or 40 minutes. Like, oh, yes, well, I was young and dumb, you know? Life! Life! Two, four, six, eight. Who do we appreciate? Mm -mm -mm. 
Should have pretty young, but I could definitely see how much. Oh, I just. Yeah. People never stop changing, though. Never, ever, never, ever. Can I catch a stupid lobster? It's 5,000 bells. Like, it's rare, but it's not that rare. It's barred knife jaw rare. Uh. Why is Nintendo adding more activities to the game where everything's shadowed? Why can't everything be like the bugs where you can see everything before you get it? So you choose to ignore it or not. No. Time to waste money for video games. Yeah. I'll show you what you're gonna buy. I gotta pee. Can you guys know what this is? Right above my finger. Wait, you can't really see anything. It's like it's like a little circle. It looks like there's supposed to be a button there, but there's not. It's weird. It almost looks like a, like a little like plastic piece you can, like pop out and put a button. Splunky one and two. Ooh, nice. Have fun. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Meow 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 meow. Waste. We haven't gotten a uh, seashell for today either for uh, Pascal. What is it called? Oh, the muscle? No. The pee pee poo poo? Yes. I got a peach. I got a peach. I got a peach. I got a peach. Um, I have no idea what I'm going to stream from, by the way. I really want to see what I could do with this flash video, and that's why this stream is going to be short as well, by the way. We're going to probably only just want this one inventory, so I could just write like a maniac, and then wake up early tomorrow and record, and then start editing and figure all the footage I need before flash fire goes bye-bye. Hopefully the Lost Lights haven't already, like, tanged down all their flash shit. Um. Damn it. A shrimp. Uh, so we'll, we'll see how that goes. Uh, that's not a bunch of bubbles, so you're gonna ignore that. That's not a lot of bubbles either, but whatever, okay. There's my premium version that has another button. The manufacturer has the same mold to make them both. That's probably true. I've been bamboozled! Well, it's very strange. I've never seen that on a remote before. This is actually my first remote, too. I've gotten with voice command on it. Can you see it? Right right there, above my finger. Wait, now I can't see it. I got an Android TV, which is hilarious because I have Apple currently. But I will be getting Android eventually in a year's time. So if this TV actually lasts longer, perhaps I can actually, <laughs> you know, make use of the Android feature. I don't really know what it does, but that's crazy. I know, right? It's insane. I can't believe it after all these years. I can't believe I got a brand new painting today. So yeah, I don't know when I'll be live tomorrow, but I do when I do go live, I'll definitely be streaming for quite a while, so look forward to that. Don't know what I'm gonna do tomorrow. I will probably I'm gonna probably be destroying my TV tomorrow. So if you're if you're curious about that, then maybe I'll do that before midnight, you know. I'm out of a room for money. Let's put that away. I wonder what the premium version button would be. Also, this round's dumb. It's so fucking long, dude. Why is it so long for? It's ridiculous. Without even trying. Like the remote from my last TV? Look at this! A good remote, right? Classic size, but look how fucking like what is this shit? It's way too big! And like look at all the space down here with nothing! Why is this so fucking long? It's ridiculous! And look at this! Look at this! Check this out! Look how much space for just putting the batteries! It's ridiculous! 
Why is this so fucking long? What is this? Who designed this shit? Well, like, what? It doesn't make any sense. It doesn't serve a purpose. Unless maybe for like the voice command stuff, they need more room. That's the only thing I can think of. Why, like, why else would that exist? I really can't think of another reason. I'll never lose it. Eh, maybe. I mean, I'm never lo like I have just as much chance of losing this. This remote's skinnier, but th but it's this one's like thicker. Oh, that's what that means. So maybe it, maybe it, I don't know. I would happen like I don't know. Maybe it's like because like today's society is obsessed. At least, like, you know, the Apple uh, with making the phone as skinny as possible. By the way, I had 140,000 points, and then I'm, now I'm down to 79,000, so that's fine. Um, like, was, I would happily take the girth one. But, yeah, I guess, like, I'm guessing maybe that's, like, because, you know, all, all the day, these days, everyone's like, oh, skinnier phones. Maybe it's like, oh, we need to make a skinnier mobile, but that means we have to make it super fucking long and ridiculous. Like, ah, but people like skinny things. That's the only thing I can think of, like, why they made this remote so fucking long, dude. It's ridiculous. Without even trying, how does he do it? Anyways. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm probably going to smash my TV tomorrow, so look forward to that. I love you all very much. Hope you have a good night. It was a very short stream, but, I mean, I got some, I got stuff to do. So, have a, have a fantastic night, everyone. Also, hopefully my webcam is lagging less. I looked into it yesterday. Turns out I actually did have my webcam plugged into um, like a USB 2.0. So I plugged it into a 3.0 now. So hopefully I, my webcam will lag less. Anyways, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!